guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get some custom skins in Minecraft. And don't mind the background, um, yeah. <laughs> so the first one is these camouflage skins apps. So all of these are from apps from the App Store and they're all completely free. This is the camouflage skins. You can download these to, you know, camouflage and stuff. So let's say I wanted to download this one. I want it to be a stone. Then I press save. And I get, and I have to like look at an ad, but that's the only bad part. But like twenty second ad, and then you get a completely free, um, a completely free, super duper cool uh, skin. So that's pretty nice. Free. Yeah. Also, uh, a Toby texted you and Adriana too. Okay, I know. Whoever. That and is. yeah, and there's super duper lots of camouflage skins and stuff. So that's really cool. Okay, now it's saved in gallery. I'm eating something. I'm hungry. Okay. And another thing is over here, I have an Among Us skin for Minecraft, and I can download whatever Among Us skin that I want, and I can use it in Minecraft. And there's a lot, so that's pretty cool. Another one is mob skins. This one just has a lot of mob skins and stuff that you can download. And also, these are completely free, too. <gasps> Wait a minute. Was that Pooh Bear? Oh, <gasps> that's so cute. Okay, I want it. And then you can save in gallery. And it says skin saved in gallery. And that's awesome. So, this one's another just kind of flat skin one. But this one is called Skin Editor Minecraft. You can choose a skin and then you can empty it or keep it. I'm just going to empty it so I can make my own one. And I press OK. OK. And then now continue to app. And now, hey, Catherine. We have, this is your head. This is what your head is going to be. So then you go into is the cup. Okay, I don't care. Oh, yeah. And then you, hey, that's a great fizzy. That's mine. Fine, then just have this. No more fizzies. That's mine. <laughs> you have your own. I ate all mine. Well, too bad for you. We all have the same amount, you know. So whatever. And then we can pick whatever skin color that we want. Well, like this it's one. Sorry. And you can choose your skin color. I'll take this, and it's going to appear there. You can't color it right now. So on the bottom, you got to lock it, lock it, and then you can start coloring your face or head or whatever. And it doesn't have to be skin color. It can be whatever you want. It can be a green blob or a red blob or whatever. It doesn't have to be anything. And now if you want to move it, you got to unlock it, move it, and then lock it again, and then you can keep coloring it. And color, 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 color. Uh, cancel. This one's a super duper cool um uh thing and I think I really and I really really like this one. Cause you can like make your own custom skins. But it does take a lot of time kind of if you want to make like a good skin. Because you gotta color and everything. Okay, I don't even need to color that one, because I'm gonna do the head. Next we're gonna add the uh, but sometimes there's like ads for this, but it's alright. Okay, <laughs> next we're going to need, let's say, we'll have purple eyeballs. And we'll put, and then we're going to move it, lock it. You can't forget to lock it. Then add two eyeballs like that. Then go back. Let's add a white one. There's our eyeball. And you can make it as big or as small as you want, or you can put it anywhere that you want, the eyeball. Hmm, hmm, hmm. The color of the hair. What color should we do, Catherine? Hmm? Let's do pink hair. No, let's do pure hair. Eh, pink hair it is. Fine. And then you can choose whatever color you want. And there's so many, like, color palettes, which is the really good thing. Okay. The teal hair is really pretty. Mm -hmm. And now we go like that. But then, now it's only, like, the top. So you gotta lock it and do the top and the bottom and everything that you want. And like this one's super. Uh oh, what did I just do? Don't. And then if you're like, why isn't mine working? Make sure to check that your thing is locked, because if it's not locked, it won't work. There you go. That's a really cute skin. Uh oh. Okay. And sometimes like you accidentally color somewhere. So you can always cover that back up. Okay, I actually kind of like this skin, so I'm going to keep this. It's actually really cute. 
You can keep coloring it and, you know, make your own skin. This, but this is just like the head because, you know, you're going to have other stuff on your head, not just your head. So, like, you're going to need your arm and your hair and all that stuff. So, now let me show you how to get those. If I go like that, that looks better, don't it? Yeah, so, and if you're making a head, I, th I think you should leave some space left over on the sides like this a little bit. So, it does have a little bit of more space on it. Okay, so like this, and now to do, that's the head, now we go back, now we go to the body, and we can have kind of like a lavender body here, like that, perfect, on the side, like this, and then you can color the clothes anywhere you like, any way you like. And the thing about the clothes is that, like, you can add patterns and stuff. And you can, like, make the colors, like, kind of, like, vary to make it look more realistic or more cuter or whatever. And stuff to make your own custom shirt. And the rest is the same with all the clothes. Like, over here, you can do leg, other leg, arm, thing, and everything. And you get to decide, like, which way you do it. And after this... That's my skin, and then you can add some. We should, and on the shirt, don't just make it like a blob. Make sure to add like a neck, kind of, and then add some designs around the neck to make it more cuter, like that. See, that's way better than just having a big, ginormous blob. And I think we'll have some pink here, and then we'll have. How do you, like, do I want it like that? Maybe I'll have a pink and purple shirt. I don't know. I mean, that's kind of cute. Ooh, and then if you want, you can kind of like like these lines and stuff. So mine's going to be pink now and stuff. Okay, sorry guys. It's kind of taking long. But I just wish they add like the whole thing one color. So you don't have to always like do it one by one by one. But it's still really nice. I mean, you can make your own custom ones. And this is also free, if I didn't say before. Now do your left leg. And then you can have any color you want. I think I want, like, kind of like this color, maybe. I don't know. And make sure to lock it. Like, I say so many times. Like, lots of times I forget to lock it. I'm like, why isn't it working? But it's because I haven't locked it. Okay. So, yeah, this is how you do it. And after that, you got to go to here, and then you name the skin something, blah, blah, blah. And then you press save, and then you press OK. Then it's going to start saving, and then go into your inventory. And then how to equip it, uh, if you go into Minecraft, and then you go to your um, changing skin, oh, whatever. I'll show you guys later after I'm done. So let me be right back. Okay, guys, I'm done with mine. Isn't it kind of cute? And we have a nice ponytail at the back, a pink shirt, and then some little uh, feet. Oh, wait, I forgot to color the bottom. And the good thing is that you can always... Ooh, ooh, oh, no. You can always color the bot. You can always color it back if you forget or something. <sighs> mm -hmm. But the other sad thing is that if you accidentally color it, like, you know, that's just sad. Unlock... The bottom is that it's got to be black, though. Okay, so now we're done with this. This is my character. I think it's very cute. And, of course, you can make your own character. Then I said it, um, let's call it pastel. You got, you just got to name it. Then press it OK. And then there's going to be an add. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it downloaded. That's good. Then we got to go to Minecraft now. We're going to go to Minecraft. Mm -hmm. And then once you go to Minecraft, you got to go to... Okay, come on, Minecraft, load! Mm. And now... Once it loads, you go to your profile, 
And then this is your this is my profile right now, this Among Us one. And you go to edit character. Then you go to you're gonna get end up here. And you're gonna go to own on this part and then go to own and press import. Choose new skin. And then go to gallery in my case. And then I have lots of skins here. So I'm gonna use the skin that I just made. And it's gonna load. Come on. And then now we just press it and look. You have your skin on Minecraft. And now you have your own custom skin in Minecraft. Oh no, I forgot to color the back. Oh well, it's all right. But so this is how you make your own custom skin in Minecraft. I hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys in the next video. Bye.